Are you ready for today's story? <laughs> Let's go! My bedtime stories! <laughs> Read with me as we make the world more magical one story at a time. Lucille Gets Jealous Written by Julie Gasman, Illustrated by Charlotte Cook Lucille was jealous of her friends at school. She was jealous of the boy across the street. And Lucille was specially jealous of her little sister, Margaret. Every day, something happened to make Lucille a bit more jealous of Margaret. One day, Margaret drew all over the kitchen table with markers. Did she get in trouble? No, but Lucille did, for leaving the markers out. Another time, Lucille was all set to watch fashion fairies. Lucille, I need to make supper and Margaret is a little whiny. Mom said, please let her watch cuddle cats. When Lucille's grandma came to visit, everything Margaret did impressed her. Oh, my honey bear can say book! Grandma exclaimed, big deal! Whispered Lucille, I can actually read. Oh, my honey bear can fetch her shoes. Grandma said, It's not like she puts them on herself. Mumbled Lucille. Oh, my honey bear can eat with a spoon. Grandma cheered. That's not even hard. Muttered Lucille. Grandma was even impressed with how Margaret slept. Oh, that Margaret is the sweetest little honey bear, Grandma whispered to Mom. Why doesn't anybody see that I'm sweet too? wondered Lucille. And just like that, Lucille knew what she needed to do. She walked straight into the kitchen and went to work. When Grandma made her way into the kitchen, she found quite the surprise. Lucille, what are you doing? She asked. I'm becoming a honey bear like Margaret. Then you will think I am sweet and smart and funny too. Oh, Lucille, said Grandma, you don't need to cover yourself with honey. I already know you are all those things, and you are a wonderful big sister on top of it all. I am? Asked Lucille. You are, said Grandma. That is why Margaret is growing into such a nice little girl. She's watching you. Lucille thought about all the time she played with Margaret. Oh, said Lucille, I guess you're right. Now, let's clean up this mess before your mom sees. This can be our secret, my lovely little ladybug, Grandma said. Lucille's smile shined right through the honey. She didn't feel jealous of Margaret anymore. In fact, she didn't feel jealous of anyone. She did, however, feel quite sticky. Thank you so much for staying and reading with me until the end. Please give this a thumbs up if you enjoyed this and share it with your friends so we can all read along together. See you on our next one. Bye!